Hello, let's say that for our project, we have duration start and finish, as we always do. But let's say that we have pessimistic duration and that we, we have pessimistic end date. So, start date is start date. But let's say that we have pessimistic duration, which is duration field, and pessimistic end date. For that purpose, I'm going to use project tab, and I'm going to choose custom field. And I will use custom field for tasks, not for resources. And I will choose duration type of uh, custom field, and I will rename it as pessimistic duration. And I will say OK, and OK, and I will put it here. OK, I will put it here like pessimistic duration. Now, OK, I can put here, here whatever I want. Now, here, I will put some new uh, custom field, which will be called pessimistic end date. For their purpose, I will use also this uh, custom field for task, but I need a date. OK. And I will say that this date, OK, will be called pessimistic end date. End date. OK. And I will say OK. But I want this field to be calcul calculated. Like formula, OK. And it says, OK, if you enter something in pessimistic date, it will be erased. I couldn't care less. Formula, and I will say that pessimistic end date is going to be date, like finish date, OK, plus, OK, which field? Duration number one. So I will see duration here, and I will say, OK, let's find this duration under custom duration, pessimistic duration. So pessimistic duration, pessimistic end date is finish date plus pessimistic duration. Uh, sorry, sorry, wrong. Not finish date, start date. So let's uh, once again go to field, go to date, and let's uh, uh, find here start. Start. So I obviously make a mistake. Start plus pessimistic duration. It will lead us, once again, it will be calculated, it will lead us to pessimistic end date. Now, let's say pessimistic end date, and you will see that I have here pessimistic end date uh, the same as finish date. Let me put here that pessimistic duration is, let me get rid of those two, two fields so it will be easy to compare. I will uh, hide column this one and hide column this one. So you see, pessimistic uh, duration for task one is one day, for task two is two days, three days, four days, five days, six days, here is zero. Let me, let me say that pessimistic duration is same for as uh, the real duration. Now, you will see that for uh, task one, Pessimistic end date is not 24th of uh, April, but is 16th of August. And for task six, it is not 1st of May, it is 13th of uh, March neck at uh, 2031. So it is obviously a bug. No, it is not. Don't do that. Let me say that I will say that pessimistic duration is one minute. Okay? And let me say here that it is here two minutes. And here it is three minutes. And here it is four minutes. So I don't want to continue. So obviously pessimistic duration and uh, 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 is not calculated by days, but somehow in minutes. So we'd say 
pessimistic duration here is one minute. It means start date plus one minute is 25th. Start date plus two minutes and is 26th. What do, I, what do I have to do? One day is 480 minutes. So if I want here to have one day, one day, two days, three days, four days, etc. And I want to have here, sorry, three days, and I want to get real and real and correct result, I should go here in custom field and I will go to formula for pessimistic end date and I, I will say that pessimistic end date is start date plus duration divided by 480 minutes. Let me go to calculate and I will show you 480 minutes divided by 8 is 60 minutes per, per, uh, uh, per hour or 480 minutes divided by 60 minutes is 8 hours, which is one day. So obviously, you should be aware that duration is calculated by minutes custom duration. If you want it to transfer it to days, you should put duration divided by eight, uh, 480. And if I put it here, you will see that now I will get the result pessimistic duration is finish date plus one day is 25th. Finish date, Tuesday, plus two day is 26th. Finish day plus three days is Thursday, day, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, of course, because pessimistic end date doesn't, doesn't take in consideration calendar. So when you choose to calculate or to put some pessimistic duration and make calculation, be aware that it, it is, uh, it is uh, uh, one day is 480 minutes. But since this is not so good to have it on Sunday, etc., etc., I will choose to have a function. I will choose a function which will say that I will go here to custom field and I will put the formula and I will erase this one, okay, and I, I will say date is, okay, here, daytime formula, and you will see proj project date 8, add, project date add, and I will put date here, as here, I will choose field, I will put date, and I will put finish, okay. Here in duration, I will put here, I will go here, and I will say field, and I will go to duration, so duration, and I will say custom duration and pessimistic duration, and I will put calendar as standard. What wa will I have here? If I put OK, and if I put OK, you will see that one day is 25th, this is 27th, this is 1st of May, so it is not calculated on Sunday and Saturday because they are Work, they are non working days. So, once again, if you are using duration custom field, be aware that one day is uh, when you put one day and you don't in formula divide this duration by 400 and 
80 minutes, it will, uh, you will get the wrong result because, because the calculation is 480 minutes per day. And the, uh, when you want to calculate the duration of the, uh, uh, the, the date, for, in my case, pessimistic end date, according to some custom duration, it is much better to use built-in uh, functions like I did here in custom fields, in formula, and I used project date add. And, th and therefore, I will not have to be concerned about those minutes because Microsoft Project will calculate this for me. It is a little bit complica uh, complicated, but anyhow, you should know how you should use those fields, especially when you uh, add some custom fields and when you are making the calculations. Hope this helps. Thank you very much. Have a nice day.